Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. We have a uh, question here on the email. This is from Anur. I hope I'm saying that right. The uh, heading of the email is Fuji X-T20 or Sony Alpha 6300. He says, hi Matt, I just wanted to thank you for the videos you're making. They do help us a lot, but I still do have a concern. I'm an architect and I'm going to get my first camera. And so, and so that you know, I'm more into stills than video, a lot more into photography. And I have a budget of a thousand euros. So which camera do you think would be the best choice for me? The Sony Alpha A6300 with its kit lens or the Fuji X-T20 with the 18-55 to 28 to 4 uh, brackets. I heard some good stuff about the Fuji kit lens. And overall, I won't have more money to buy new lenses for now, so I'm going to stick with the kit lens. What do you think? What would be the best choice for me? If you have another option, I'd be glad to hear them. Thank you a lot, Matt. Keep up the good work. All right. This is an easy answer for me. Give me one second. Okay. So this is what I would go with right here. Fuji X-T20. I like this camera a lot more than I like the A6300 as a photographic tool. Uh, not only um, do I like it better um, just because it looks cooler, uh, but all the manual dials are not only uh, impressive from an aesthetic point of view, but just the pure functionality and ergonomics of being able to set them um, with a dedicated dial just makes it such a joy when you're shooting. Um, the Fuji color science and the Fuji lenses, uh, especially if you're going to be sticking with the kit lens, make this far superior to the A6300 offering with its kit lens because A6300's kit lens is a very weak lens, not a very good performer at all. Whereas this guy here, right now on the Fuji, I've got the 50 uh, F2, which is a fantastic lens. But this guy here, as I've said many times, this is the 28 to 4, um, 18 to 55. This is one of the nicest kit lenses I've ever seen. Metal body construction, so smooth and just fit and finish is beautiful on this thing so smooth on the zoom so smooth and the resistance this is this is really a lens that punches far above its price tag um it's the i think the best kit lens ever made at least in as far back as i can remember uh, a beautiful lens very very strong offering uh, and 2.8 at the wide end or you can just use it as a constant aperture f4 if you want to um, great, great lens. Comes with a nice um, hood here. Did I put that on right? Yes, I did. And uh, so that's what I would do. Um, I love this Fuji. It's uh, It does 4K. It does it very well. It has comparable autofocus as far as um, to tracking in video. Um, the Sony, I've been saying for a while, is probably, is, is probably the second only to Canon's class-leading dual-pixel AF. But actually, Fuji um, is a very close contender in there. Their, their dual pixel AF style focus for continuous video is very good. It's very tweakable. You can go in and, and adjust it and, and kind of set it up the way you want it. And it's a great system. And for a photographic tool, this thing is awesome. Um, I mean, there's a reason people love the X series. They're just really, really strong uh, contenders in the market. Uh, the 24 megapixel APS-C sensors in these things very, very nice, very nice image files, and great video now too, 4K. So, and when you compare that, when, when, when you add that in to the fact that you want to stay with a kit lens, this guy is the lens to go with. It's going to absolutely kill the A6300's kit lens. So that's what I would do. What would you guys do? Do you agree with me on the Fuji? I'm very strong on my opinion on this one because this is an awesome setup, and I very heartily suggest you get this. Um, but Throw it back to you guys. What would you guys do? Do you agree with me? Do you disagree? Let me know which way you would go and why. And um, leave it in the comments below. Curious to hear your feedback. And uh, let's help out Anor. I hope I'm saying that right. And uh, thanks for your question. Stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at ArtOfTheImage.com.